In this video, I have to make a West Coast beat for EBK Jbo, but I'm only allowed to use stock VSGs. Let's get it, bro. All right, so for these type of beats, I always feel like they're slower than your average West Coast beat. So instead of being at like the 90, we're gonna drop it down to like 87. And I feel like a lot of the EBK Jbo songs that I've been dropping lately have been having like the dark, deep piano in them. So we're gonna actually start out with that. So if you go down to the search bar right here, just type in compressed. And then boom, you can just take the compressed piano, drop it in and boom. Now you have the FL keys version of the compressed piano. So we're just gonna make like a really simple like bass line. Ooh, there we go, bro. Wow, that is heavily pan to the left, okay. Mm, there we go, there we go, there we go. Hold up, that might've been the perfect note off rip. Maybe we can change it up a little bit. Maybe like something like this at the end. Hard. You know what? I did really like this pattern right here, but I think I'm gonna change it up. It's too easy. I feel like everybody's gonna go that route. I wanna make it a little bit different at least. I'm thinking maybe just mess with like the dark notes and do something like this, like. Okay, okay, we're kind of there, but like, let's change up like the pattern, like the bounce of it. Ooh, that's kind of different, hold on. Okay, that's a great starting point. All right, cool. Now let's get this pattern right here and let's copy it over into like a synth base. You feel we can just get all the low end taken care of right now. What do we got for stock synth base? SAR. Okay, I remember people talking about SAR. I feel like people use GMS and SAR a lot. Oh, this is the one that has like the infamous Detroit base. Wait, where is it? 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 Ah, oh, it's this one. This is like the classic, like everybody uses this base for like Detroit stuff. We ain't gonna use that one though. We ain't gonna use that one though. Let's just uh, scroll through them and just see what we can mess with, bro. And you know what? I'm literally just gonna copy this over and do that. And just to also save room for like frequency, kind of get the mixing out the way. I'm gonna cut out a little bit of the low end right here. Let's see what this sounds like now. Okay, okay, that's not bad. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. We kind of cooking now. We kind of cooking now. Hold on, wait. Mm. Hold up now. Now this one is nice, but you know what? I think I'm feeling the first one a little bit more. There we go. So now let's just do a couple cuts in here real quick just to make it a little bit more bouncy. Something like this right here. Like one right here too just to switch it up on the other side uh, maybe we could just keep it the same <laughs> maybe we could just keep it exactly the same Hard. okay cool 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 now let's get like a kick in here real quick so we're just gonna take this hit control c go over here hit control v and then if you don't know the trick you about to find out hit alt k and accept make sure that your window looks like this or else it won't work and then boom look they're all on the c note just like that so now we just do that we just see what this sounds like oh you know what? let's just throw in a clap too <laughs> Bro, am I smoking dope? Apparently so, bro. So I messed up the claps. Who messes up the claps, brother? Hey, I got to swear the whole black that made me mad enough. Mm -hmm, right to bed, ain't y'all had enough? All right, now let's get more like melodic elements in here real quick. Maybe we can go to like, uh, oh, you know, let's add a pad. Let's add a pad. I haven't touched this VST in a while, but I remember really liking this VST right when I started out. Like before I got like other VSTs and stuff like that, I was using Citrus heavy, bro. So let's get like a very ambient pad up in this thing, bro. Okay. That's just
That was loud, bro. That was so loud, brother. Okay, let's get that velocity down. Then we just do. Okay, we're changing the preset right now because I don't want to hear that anymore. Okay, above the clouds too. Let's see if that works. I don't know. I don't know now. Then we just do like the classic little Travis Scott thing. Boom. Okay. Okay. Get some reverb on this thing. Make it wider. Okay. 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 This ain't too bad, bro. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Let's go. Um. Sakura. I remember liking Sakura a lot too. Let's add like a like a counter melody kind of thing. Maybe just. Maybe just do like one of them like off centered chords like this. And then maybe have it like delay out or something like that. Okay, cool. I can rock with that. I can rock with that. Let's uh let's throw some hi hats in this thing real quick, bro. Ooh, okay. Well, wait, we might be cooking now. Ooh, I kind of like that bounce. Do something like that. Oh, you know what? We need to get those those like lasers. You know, I've been using my own drum kit all the time, and that's what we've been using so far for the most part. But I need to use some stuff from like the homies, bro. I need uh, one of them lasers, bro. I need like exactly. That's exactly what I need, actually. Shout out to Johnny for making that the first one. <laughs> Oh, wait, I just saw Smoop a Tom, bro. Wait, let's do a Tom for the end. Make sure it's dark. Something like this. Mm -hmm. Now let's do this over here, but let's like change it and make it different. Mm -hmm. Wait, 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 infinite go-to drum kit. I'll be using this sound way too much, but it's just gonna hit, bro. Okay, 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 let's get some other stuff in here, bro. Let's start layering on that kick real quick. Yeah, something like that. Wow, why am I just choosing every, like, first sound that I see, bro? Wait, uh, yeah, there we go. Okay, okay. Let's see where we are real quick. Oh, I didn't finish the hi-hats. That is something that I like. I enjoy this. Oh, let's throw like some more perks in here, bro. Yeah, I'm gonna do it right there, actually. Sometimes you gotta like sound out the beat. Oh yeah, we can throw some stomps up in here, bro. Ooh. I, I almost need like a stomp right here. Oh, maybe we should use a different stomp. Uh, oh, also, by the way, this is the E Trizzle West Coast Deluxe Drum Kit. It is available on gatekeepsounds.com. So if you want to get this 808, the one that like every single J-Bo song has, 
it's right there also it's just a really solid like drum kit i really like it i've been using it for years a lot of west coast producers have been using it for years i've seen it in person before like i've 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 linked up with like certain like popular west coast producers and i'll watch them cook up and then they'll use this kit Ooh, 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 ooh. hold up that is so loud bro all right then brother let's see where we at right now Um, more melodic elements. Let's go to FL keys and then we can throw like some delay on here real quick and then some reverb on here too. Uh, uh I don't know if I was feeling that. cooking right now do a little strum right there Ooh, i kind of like that more actually you know what we're doing this whole stock vst challenge but we're not even using like the new goat of like stock vst stuff flex bro so let's like let's add some strings in here or something like that yeah let's do like some sustained stuff like that <laughs> I think we just do something simple like that but just turn it down like so much more uh legacy kit time i want to throw some vocals in here bro Ooh. Mm. that's damn near one of them ones maybe we can get like another key and then we can like pitch it That's hard. So, quick intermission. If you don't know, you've been living under a rock. The Legacy Kit is out now. It is available on gatekeepsounds.com and it's on sale for 75% off, brother. There's easily over $200 worth of value in this kit, but it's only being sold for $50. There's over 500 sounds, bro. Just, just, just put that into perspective. $50 for over 500 sounds? That's crazy. That's not even including like the MIDI. I'm talking about like actual sounds, like things that you can hear there's 150 vocals there is a hundred loops that are in there that are all royalty free there's one shots in there midi melodic starters accents but also if you ain't got the bread like that or maybe you just don't feel like buying the kit i did put out a free version which has like a little bit of everything from the kit first thing in the description brother oh that's that's damn near the one right there. Let's throw this on a mixer channel. This is actually one of the Vox Mix presets from the Legacy yeah. Kid. You see how much of a difference that makes, bro? Let me turn off the effects real quick. Listen to it. Okay. Turn it on. Saucy, bro. Saucy. Yes, 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 more of this. <laughs> I low key want to add more vocals in, bro. Ooh, maybe we can like cut that one out. I feel like there's one more pocket where we can put vocals. So we might just top it up. Let's just see if I got it right on the first try. <laughs> Maybe we can do some like weird and quirky. Maybe we can just take that, make it unique, reverse it, and then put it over here. Do something like that. Mm, I like that. I like that. That is something that I like. All right. So I really like how this beat is sounding so far. So I'm going to mute the mic, turn on the speakers, and listen to it from a different point of reference. I don't know about y'all. I don't really like cooking up a headphones like that, but I have to do it for the videos because like audio issues and everything like that. I always feel more comfortable hearing it on the speakers. So y'all are going to see me kind of like do the whole mixing, mastering thing real quick. <laughs> I 
right, so mix wise, master wise, I like where it's sounding right now. It sounds stoo, bro. So what we're gonna do is just arrange it like really, really quickly, to be honest. I don't wanna spend that much time on arranging just cause like, I feel like we already know arranging stuff and everything like that. I already have videos about it. So I'm just gonna kind of organize everything how I like it. I like having all the melodic stuff on top and then having all the drum stuff on the bottom. Intro, we can get rid of boom, boom. Boom, 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 all that stuff. We bring the strings in on the second half, and then we can start bringing in the drums on the second half, too. Oh, let me get my tag in there. I can't forget to bring in the tag, brother. Okay, okay. I wasn't trying to do that, but I am not mad at that. And then maybe, like, right before the hook, we can do, like, a little four count thing. These, right here. Chop that. Boom. And then that thing but just to make it a little bit more different we can just delete one of them oh should we do a 808 switch up yeah maybe we should do 808 switch up take that and we'll just copy this over into the 808 this is the anomaly 808 um it is in the multiverse drum kit so if you want to grab that gatekeepsounds.com maybe we can make it a little bit different boom reverse 808 trick i feel like people really like this all right let's sound it out and just try to like move things around so we can get like a cool arrangement hey go ahead infinite Ooh, like, i was not ready for that That works. That works. So we got intro, hook, verse, hook, verse, hook, outro. And that's going to conclude the video. If you like the video, hit the like. If you want to comment, throw a comment. If you want to sub, hit the sub. My name is Devin. I also go by Infinite, probably by Infinite, owner of gatekeepsounds.com, brother. I'm out.